This video will cover how to apply to participate in any of the Federal Home Loan Bank of Boston's home ownership programs, Equity Builder, Housing Our Workforce, or Lift Up Home Ownership. Federal Home Loan Bank of Boston member financial institutions must apply to participate in each home ownership program annually as funding and conditions do change. Currently, members can apply to participate in EVP and HOW through the same application, only to apply to participate in Lift Up Home Ownership separately. To apply to any of these programs, first log into the Community Lending Login System. Next, select the program you would like to apply for from the left-hand side menu, either EBP and HOW through this link or Lift Up Home Ownership through this link. Once you are into that program, select Create Manage My Member Application from the left-hand menu. Any applications that you have started for this year will show, or if you do not have any started, you may select Create, he click here to create new application. Be sure to review the application details, then select Begin Application. On the Member Information screen, ensure that your contact information is correct and be sure to add at least two and up to four contacts for your organization as the main type of pro contacts for this program. These contacts will receive all program-related notifications. To add a second contact, simply select Add a Second Contact, then select the name from the drop-down menu. If the name you wish to add does not appear, select enter a new contact, fill out the information, then select save these changes. If you need to update the contact information to any of these, select update, first contact, second contact, third contact, etc. Once all the contact information is correct, you can continue to the next screen. On the next screen, be sure to read all the application details and select this button attesting you agree to the statements, then fill out some questions about your organization and how you plan to use the programs. Then continue to the next section. If you're applying to participate in Equity Builder or Lift Up Home Ownership, a program concession is required. This is a benefit you agree to give the home buyer for participating in the program. This, can, this could include a waived or reduced fee, a lender credit, or a below market interest rate. We do allow other expanded underwriting guidelines. So if you'd like to allow, if you'd like to offer other expanded underwriting guidelines, just let us know and we will work with you to get those approved. On this screen, you must enter the concession you plan to offer home buyers. For example, if you are offering a below market interest rate, you would select below market interest rate. And in this field, you would select what a normal home buyer might receive today. And then in this field, you can put what a lift up home buyer might receive today. Then you can continue to the next section. On the next screen, be sure to review the training requirements and be sure that all people who touch the program from your organization are properly trained and have access to our training resources. Click here to attest that you agree to the member training statements, and then continue to the next section. On the following screen, you can select the home buyer education and counseling agencies you plan to have your program home buyers participate in. Education and counseling is required for all first time home buyers of all programs. If you wish to see if an organization could be added, upload the curriculum on the following exhibit page. And the program man manager will reach out to you. So on this screen, just select the organizations you plan to offer education through. And then you can continue to the next screen. And on this exhibit screen is where you could upload a curriculum if you want to add a new home buyer education resource. If you do not need to add any exhibits, you can simply continue to the next screen. On this screen, you will select the individual organization who will be responsible for signing the program agreement. On the screen, review all the instructions, then select who you wish to sign the program agreement. Then select the radio button at the bottom of the screen, indicating that you have read and understand the agreement instructions that continue to the next screen. On this screen, you can validate and submit any information that you must enter. In this case, I have to add a second contact, so I'll do that now. Select to use this contact. You can see the contact information is now saved. 
I can then continue through the whole application or simply go to the validate and submit screen. And now you can see that all information is validated, at which time I can continue. On this screen, I can do one last review of the application to make sure all the information is accurate. And then I can select continue to sign and submit. And on this page, uh, you need to attest uh, that you certify that everything in the application is accurate. And to do that, simply type your name exactly as appears in this field into the signature box and then submit application. Once you get this thank you screen, you know that you have applied to the program and Federal Home Bank of Boston will be in touch with your approval.